General advice on buying a mini shuttle bus from private sellers and licensed dealerships. A buyer can either purchase these buses from former owners, private sellers or from licensed bus dealerships. A licensed dealership will recondition the bus thoroughly and give it a fresh appearance so they are ready to use immediately. Alternatively, if the buyer decides to buy the bus from the original owner, private individuals or random sellers then he or she needs to fix the vehicle before using. Rarely is a used bus in excellent condition from a private seller. Why would they want to dispose off a serviceable vehicle otherwise? This could potentially involve many additional costs that can run into thousands of dollars and not be easily accomplished by local repair shops. Good advice is to hire an independent inspection company to thoroughly inspect the bus from the outside, inside, and underneath. The inspection should include a test drive, photos, a complete checklist and a vehicle history report. Then, based on the report provided by the inspector, fix the vehicle. Some of the parts that may need replacement are alternators, water pumps, starters, pulley bearings, power steering pumps, steering stabilizers, brake calipers, ball joints, other front end parts, air conditioning problems and wheelchair issues. It will be good to make these repairs before purchase so that the buyer knows that their bus will be safe, serviceable and last a long time. Other smaller parts such as, engine mounts, axles, motor mounts, floors or rusted sidewalls should be replaced as needed. Cutting corners is not an option when buying a pre-owned vehicle because it can risk the lives of passengers, drivers and other road users. The buyer shouldn't need to do all the repairs and replacements as they are typically unqualified and inexperienced in bus maintenance. Ironically many buyers underestimate the time and expense required to make a used bus ready for service. Bus repair is an expensive and time-consuming hassle and many buyers just don't want to go through it. They are only interested in driving the bus and transporting people right away. Therefore it's better and safer to buy the vehicle from licensed bus dealerships as they should have already done all the difficult maintenance for the buyers. They make every used bus fit to drive again and even get it certified from the Department of Transportation. A used bus sold by a dealership is most likely to cost more, maybe up to 15% extra than a bus that is being sold as is by the owner. It is worth dealing with a dealership because it spares buyers the time, hassle, and headache of repairing a second-hand bus. Most first-time buyers simply do not have the knowledge nor the experience for reconditioning a bus and they can be financially abused by almost every person they encounter from the seller, repair shop, mechanic, parts retailer, and everyone else in between causing a lot of heartaches in their purchase. Why should a buyer go through all that unless they intend to be a bus maintenance expert in the near future? Buses are needed to safely drive people around and that should be every buyer's primary concern. Major Vehicle Exchange is a used bus dealership that has sold its fully inspected, detailed and reconditioned buses to customers across the United States for more than three decades. For more information visit Major Vehicle Exchange at www.getanybus.com and call the owner Charles Kaufman at 516-333-7483 today.